The Accessible City Video is a compilation of innovative practices and policies from around the world. We are proud to exhibit some of their successes in this video. Accessibility Directorate of Ontario. The Integrated Accessibility Standards Regulation includes five standards. Design of public spaces, employment, information and communication, transportation and customer service that aim to remove barriers and help Ontario reach its goal of an accessible province by 2015. Measures that have been taken range from courtesy seating in public buses to adjusted stop buttons that are accessible for people using mobility devices to providing customer service for people with disabilities to beach accessibility by using mats. City of Rio de Janeiro the Federal University of Rio de Janeiro has produced an accessibility guide and is using it as a tool to increase public social participation. Measures that have been taken range from accessible volleyball courts wherein the height of the net and the size of the court are adjustable, to carpets placed on the beach for mobility device users. In a museum, maps and art are made accessible for the visually impaired using tactile maps as well as tactile art. A ramp has been built into a botanical garden, making it accessible for mobility device users. Sinks have been lowered to be accessible for mobility device users. And train station platforms are built to be level to trains. The South Africa Public Transport Network Development the South Africa Department of Transport has developed a national strategy which includes universal design to guide cities in providing accessible public transport systems. Pavements have been raised in order to be level with the bus and its ramps. All accessible buses have designated seating that have safety belts. The buses have step-free access to the stop buttons and exits. Buses also include an automatic fare collection system that is translated into braille and has enlarged text. Minibuses are equipped with platform lifts to provide safe curbside boarding. Grenoble The French city of Grenoble began to address accessibility as early as the 1970s. 80% of public spaces in the city centre are accessible as well as 100% of all tram stations. Accessible housing has been developed, including a range of features, from accessible bathrooms to button-controlled locks. Brookfield Zoo. Based on the principles of universal design, the Brookfield Zoo in Chicago has made its facility easily accessible, as well as providing accessible transport and tactile exhibits. Paths have been constructed to be wide and flat, and tactile animal statues have been built for the visually impaired. The buildings have been made accessible for mobility device users, through wide ramps and wide automatic doors. The zoo offers safari tours using minibuses that are accessible through its ramps and include companion seating. Musholm. Musholm, based on the principles of universal design, is a recreation centre with room and space for differences. Their hallways are wide and have a continuous hand railing. Entering the building is made easier due to the flat and hard surfaces that lead to the wide automatic doors. Their indoor facilities such as their bathrooms are accessible. The handles are within easy reach of the user and the height of the toilet can be easily altered. One can independently travel through the building with the use of door opening buttons located at a height that is reachable for everyone. Telemark. The county of Telemark made their outdoor spaces more accessible through universal design with its main focus on walking trails. Their trails are wide flat and have a hard surface so that mobility device users can easily travel independently. 
The hard surfaces are helpful for better grip when on wheels or shoes. Other trails have a wooden surface, also beneficial for grip. Rails are located at the side of the path to ensure maximum safety for travellers. Scandic Hotels More than 13 years ago, Scandic began its journey to make its hotels more accessible for people with disabilities. Throughout the hotels, there are tactile floors for the visually impaired. and adapted furnishings and spaces to fit everyone's needs. One can even find cane holders throughout the hotel. Rooms and bathrooms are also accessible, including many features, such as adjustable beds, hooks and peepholes, extra spacious bathrooms with its necessary features within reach. The Central Bank of Ireland Based on the principles of universal design, the Central Bank of Ireland has made a new office facility fully accessible. The grey strips on the stairs, based on the Buildings for Everyone standard, are visible when going up as well as when going down. There is a continuous handrail on the stairs that is lit as well as in a contrasting colour. The floor finishes of the bank can help define a walkway and encourage safe access for everyone. The walkways are also broad to ensure easy circulation. The signage in the facility is large and contrasting, making it easier to read. The countertops in the restaurant are built so that people in mobility devices can come up to the counter as close as possible. The Central Bank of Ireland offers a variety of workspaces and different furniture to meet all kinds of needs. The location of all equipment in the bathroom are within easy reach of the users, as well as colour contrasting to the wall. Mary Free Bed YMCA Progressive AE Using the principles of universal design, the Mary Free Bed YMCA was designed with everyone in mind. The facility serves as a model for all future YMCA buildings both locally and around the country. There are zero thresholds throughout the entire facility. The pool is accessible for mobility device users through a step and a continuous railing. The individual can therefore enter the pool independently. The fitness equipment is also accessible. For example, a wheelchair can simply pull up directly to a weight machine. Everything in this facility has been thought through from kitchen counters to the indoor track. The track is wide and its lanes are in different colours, helping people to stay in their lane. There is also a continuous yellow railing throughout the entire track. Thank you for your attention and we hope that you were inspired by this video. We would especially like to thank the Central Bank of Ireland, the South Africa Public Transport Network Development, Progressive AE, Mary Free Bed YMCA, the Accessibility Directorate of Ontario, Scandic Hotels, Telemark County, Musholm, ACT Services and the Brookfield Zoo, the Federal University of Rio de Janeiro and the City of Grenoble.